Well, for many of us, it's going to be a light, gentle rain that's going to be falling for the next couple of hours. Could pick up a little bit in the intensity with how dry things have been so far this autumn season. We're going to soak this rainfall up across the area as much of it's going to fall overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning and gone by daybreak. Temperature wise, we are very warm. Low 70s from Finley through Bowling Green over toward Toledo, where we have a little rain cooled air and we could just barely call it rain cooled air. We're back in the mid to upper 60s, still east of I-75. We've got the lower 70s and maybe set outside this evening. You took a walk after uh, work or dinner and you enjoyed that very warm record tying weather we had. It was a windy day, still is. Winds will still gust occasionally 30 to 40 miles per hour. Head of a cold front that's going to come through while you sleep tonight. So you may hear the winds rattling uh, the uh, windows as the raindrops do come down. Now rainfall so far this fall season, we're going all the way back to the first day of September. September, we are over three and a half inches below average. Extremely dry weather. In fact, this is the driest autumn season since 1994. It's been quite some time since we've been this dry across the area at this point in the season. Now we still have more rain to get through tonight. Here's a clock as we move forward to 11 p.m. Rain is going to be spreading east of I-75. Those showers will still become more numerous between now and midnight and through early morning, 2 a.m. Could even include some downpours. Not out of the question. We get an isolated rumble of thunder and winds could gust 30 to 40 miles per hour as that front comes through. Showers could begin to taper off between uh, 2 and 5 a.m lingering a little bit longer off to the east, but they are going to be out of the picture by the time we head toward daybreak. The last of a lingering shower east over toward Erie and Huron County, and we'll see mixed clouds and sunshine return into Wednesday afternoon. Still going to be a mild day, not quite as warm as what we had for our election day Tuesday, but highs in the mid to upper 60s. Warmer weather south and east of Toledo, where we're going to reach into the upper 60s. Dry conditions will return for Wednesday after rain that's going to be likely tonight. Breeze is still going to be gusty, upper 50s tonight. Highs on Wednesday in the 60s, and our 10 day forecast is going to show low 60s Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Next rain chance beyond tonight on Sunday, and mild weather set to continue all the way through mid November.